Welcome to Alfar. In this tutorial, I'll be showing you how to assemble this fiable shelf unit from IKEA. For this build, you need a Phillips screwdriver, something pointy to poke holes with, and a level. You can also use a drill with a Phillips bit to speed up the assembly process. So the first step is to grab these two metal pieces and put them into this orientation. For the rectangular piece, just make sure these two pairs of holes are in this position. As for the leg piece, make sure these pairs of holes are in this position, then connect both pieces like this. Then grab this screw and screw it into this hole. Now grab this metal piece and make sure these ends are in this position. Also grab one screw and secure this metal piece with the screw as shown. Next, grab the metal bar that has one hole in it and put it in this orientation. Then align the metal bar like this. Now grab this screw and screw it into this hole. Next, grab this brace and this screw. Then secure the brace with the screw like this. Just make sure the smaller hole on the brace is where you'll be securing your screw through. Then grab this metal piece and connect it like this. Just make sure these ends of the metal piece are in this position. Now connect the other metal leg piece like this. Then grab four screws and screw them into these four holes. Now grab two of these metal braces and four screws. The braces will be secured into these two spots. It's going to look something like this. Next, grab four metal caps and four screws that look like this. The caps will be inserted into the top holes and the screws will be secured into the bottom holes. It's going to look something like this. So first insert the caps, then secure the caps using the screws. In instructions, it says not to fully secure them, but I didn't notice any difference in the end. I decided to screw them in all the way. Then grab this metal bar and position it like this.
Now grab this screw and screw it into this hole. And grab this screw and brace. The brace will be secured with the screw into this hole. Here's a better angle of how it's done. Now grab the smaller piece of wood and place it on like this. Just make sure everything is aligned. Then grab something pointy to poke holes with and poke eight holes into these eight spots. Now grab eight of these screws and screw them into these eight holes. Before you screw them in, just double check everything is aligned. You don't want the piece of wood sticking out more on one side than the other. Next, grab this metal piece and one screw. Then secure this metal piece with the screw like this. Now grab six adjustable feet and screw them into these six holes. Then lift the shelf unit up like this. Now grab the bigger wooden piece and this metal frame. Then place the metal frame onto the wooden piece like this. Just make sure everything is aligned. Then grab something pointy and make 8 holes in these 8 spots. Now grab 8 of these screws and screw them into these 8 holes. Before you start, just make sure everything is aligned. Then connect the top of the shelf unit like this. Just make sure these two pairs of holes are in this position. Now grab six of these screws and screw them into these six holes. Next, grab these two metal braces and six screws. The metal braces are going to be secured like this. Just make sure you don't fully screw the screws in all the way.
Now place the shelf unit against your intended wall. Then grab a level and check that everything is level. If not, then play around with the adjustable feet. Now grab the two doors and put them into this orientation. Also grab four hinges and eight screws. Then secure each hinge with two screws. It's going to look something like this. Now grab 8 more screws and secure each door with 4. It's going to look something like this. Then grab two of these smaller screws and magnets. The magnets will be secured into these two holes. Now grab a level and make sure your shelf isn't leaning too much to one side or the other. If it isn't, then fully secure these screws. Also, if you decide to keep the bottom braces loose, you can now fully secure them. Now if your doors are not aligned, just unscrew these screws and adjust the hinges up or down accordingly. This applies to both doors. Also, if the magnet doesn't want to stick, I found that loosening the screws I just pointed to helps. And if you want to secure this shelf unit to the wall, you'll be using these two holes. Unfortunately, IKEA doesn't give you any wall hardware, so you're going to have to buy your own wall anchors and screws. Now check that everything opens and closes relatively smoothly, but if you followed all these steps, then you shouldn't have any issues. So now you should have a fully assembled Fialbo shelf unit from Ikea. Hopefully this tutorial helped you out.